all right everybody welcome back to the channel we are here on the hunter call of the wild this weekend for the competitions and we are on the channel in season nine week number three and a little recap we had our super rare which qualified as the supreme huntsman for us in week one and then last week we were after the mountain goats and we got an awesome diamond there where we were able to pull off supreme huntsman back-to-back -back weeks so a little more relaxed this week we were all uh just see what what it brings us but as you can see we are out here on the beautiful quattro cleanest and we are after and the time isn't right for these guys but we are after the mouflon so looking forward to that it's been a while since we've been after these guys so uh gonna be pretty cool our top three golds we're gonna be looking for those trolls obviously and if we get any diamonds we can enter those for the supreme huntsman which is already up there pretty high but uh top three golds to try to get on them top three spots i'd like to try to hit that before the end of the season so we'll see how that goes but again we are qualified so their pressure's off we're just here to have a good time find any kind of trophies that we can find in any of the species as usual here on quattro we should have a good time because there are so many good species here and i almost always find something pretty neat whenever we come here and uh spend a few days but the uh the other three awards we can get besides getting in those top three is the supreme huntsman award which is for the largest scoring diamond of course which is what we had the last two weeks and well we'll see how that goes it's already up there pretty big dan i see you but yeah it's pretty big already so uh then there's the sniper award which is for the farthest single shot taken with this oh yeah our weapon of choice is this week the solik and that's what we're after this week and very happy to have that again because I, I love shooting this weapon it, it's a lot of fun so very nice weapon to have with these mouflon but uh the sniper were the farthest single shot taken with the solican on a male iberian mouflon with all harvest checks passed so that's that far out shot see who gets the longest one and then you know we're going to be looking for that elevation see what we can do then there is the Jackalope Award, the lowest scoring male Iberian Mouflon with all harvest checks passed. We'll be looking for those baby Mouflon as usual, and we will definitely be trying to do that. If I can remember, it's so hard to remember when you're so focused on diamonds, you're just running looking for them big racks or ram horns, whatever. We're not really always looking for those little guys. You just don't think about it when you're trying to keep moving. But we are here on Quattro, and we were going to give that a try. Hopefully, we will keep that in mind. But again, after them top three. So let's hope we can get three trolls. That's not going to happen. But let's hope we get three trolls, right? And see if we can get some big ones, because there's already big ones posted. And it's just uh, heading toward the end of the first day before we get a chance to play. So we will uh, looking forward to having this whole weekend, if I can make the time work, and we'll see how it goes. But I hope you all enjoy the video. Move on hunting. We're going. Let's get to it. Well, our first contestant is uh, <laughs> for us is right across here. A level four goes up to 176. So he's, this is the highest estimate up I have seen since I have begun hunting. So let's go ahead and try to take him. I think. Ooh, oh, now he's gonna move over there. I don't. Oh. Gotta get another angle. I was just working that angle. <laughs> ah, maybe we'll go for a heart shot. Let's just, or, or at least a front shot. Maybe not heart. Oh, he's gonna move a little more. That's fine. Get our soul looking out here and wait. Oh, thanks, buddy. Sit right there. Should be pretty good with that. Or not at all. <laughs> there he's starting to drop. Huh. Still going down very slow. That's... Hmm. Maybe we need to hit something else there. Here he is. We did not get a vital. Let's see what he was there regardless and where we hit. Oh, a 170. We could have used that for sure. Oh. Wow. <laughs> what what a way to start the weekend. First animal and we're gonna 
find it and look like we got some lung but didn't <laughs> pretty close man right in the void there golly I was aiming a little high because it was further than the uh, zeroing but didn't need to aim that high I guess that's a bummer and a 170 to boot we could definitely use that it looks like even to be in top three to do pretty good you're gonna want to be 170 plus I bet by the end of this weekend for sure on all three so he probably would have needed to be replaced but little little education with the weapon if nothing else at 206 yards don't need to quite give it that much of a bump but uh oh well way to start off maybe it can only get better <laughs> from here I hope all right all right here we go let's go for this jackalope over here we got a nice small guy the current jackalope is sitting at 76.76 .76. this guy goes down to 68 so he's got a good chance there okay make sure he's lifting his head because he was going up and down the head yeah wait for the next round all right Huh. I thought we could have cut the heart. Oh well. Alright, let's find out. Alright, let's see if we've made it. Did it get low enough? Uh, no. Not even close. 89. <laughs> That's hilarious. Right at the top of that estimate. Not even close where we wanted. But that's alright. Back to it. Well, I just alerted him, but we've got a nice big old ram over there up to 182 level 4 it could be a diamond but hopefully that's going to be in the mid to high 70s that would be perfect for a starter ram for us for this uh, competition he's got some big old hooks on him and this is perfect range so let's go with it Hopefully we didn't get too high there, or shoot too far back. I think he's angled. He was quartered away, so we should be good. All right, come on. We got to be in the 170s with that guy. Look at those horns. My gosh. Ah, 166. That looks much bigger than the 170 that we messed up. Well, we'll grab our screenshot. It's not where we want to be, but maybe something we have to hold on to. We'll at least hold on to the screenshot so we'll have it, but... Ah, oh, I thought that guy was in the 70s for sure. My gosh. <laughs> let's get back on him, I guess. Bummer, bummer. All right, let's, let's go from a little bit of a distance here. I gotta find him now. Where'd he go? Is that him moving? Nope. Uh, nope. There is one that goes up to 180 over there. Ah, there he is, but he's head on. We're going to have to get to the side. All right, here we go. Let's go. Let's go. That should be good. Good deal. Goes up to 180. We'll see if he can get in the 70s for us. Looked like a decent one from over here, so we'll find out. All right, here he is. See if we get into the 70s yet. Maybe not even close. Man. Surely this guy's in the 70s, right? I mean, look at that guy. Goes up to 85. Low end 62. Got some nice curls at the front there. This guy's got to make it for us. Oh, he's going to sit at an angle. I hate this angle. It's so hard to hit him. Let's go back over here. How close were we? About 200. We should be able to run. That's probably good. All right, here we go. Good drop there. 25. Zero down. All right. Tell me that guy's in the 70s, right? <laughs> Let's find out. I'm not sure anymore. All right, here he is. Let's see. Let's get a look. 
Got a little curl in there. Let's go. 173.22. There we did it. Anyway, 179 is diamond. So any of the 170s is where we want to be. 173 is our first one in the 170s that we're able to use. So we will get that screenshot and be able to enter him at some point here. But fantastic. So happy about that, man. I was like, man, am I ever going to find any of these? There's plenty of room in the 70s to fall, but uh, they're pretty rare. I mean, pretty tough to get anyway. And we will keep at it here. Maybe we'll find a diamond by the end of the weekend, hopefully, because these guys look awesome as a diamond, that's for sure. There we uh, go. <laughs> I've seen that guy from way back when I come over the hill. I'm closing the distance here, but we finally found a level 5 Mouflon. Man, it has been some work. Now, if he's a troll, it's going to be just fine, and he'll help us a ton. But if he's not, we're looking for that trophy. Happy to have him no matter what. A 173 to 197. They've got to be 179.6, so... Real good chance this guy's making it. That estimate is huge. But uh, I want to make sure we put this right on. Had a little bit of trouble with my uh, accuracy on this. Sulking all of a sudden. I don't know. I'm just either overthinking it or what. But let's close this down a little bit. Get a little better angle. Hopefully none of them females try to mess us up. That should do it right in there. Looks like somebody's walking down. They probably want to stand right in front of us, so let's not do that. There's our five. 173 to 197. Yeah, that's a good hit. He's already down. Good, good deal. Maybe we got a nice trophy. Let's go find out. The Sulican smashed him. Now that's what we want to see right there. Vital, vital all day long look at the girls on this guy much better looking than what we've been seeing here we go and diamond 183 86 that is awesome what a beautiful big old ram that is uh the current uh supreme huntsman's a 188.1 so we don't have to worry about that right now and that's fine we've had a couple good weeks for that so we're just happy to have a diamond trophy of these guys. I was really hoping to get one. Haven't had one in a while. Haven't been after these guys in a while. So very happy to uh, made that happen this weekend. Whew. Lots of pressure off now. But a beautiful 183.86 diamond. Get that soul looking right there. Double lung. Punched him out. Awesome. Good, good penetration there. Nice solid hit. Put him out fast. Let's get back out here and get back on these guys, but uh, we are not getting skunked on the diamonds this weekend. Very happy about that. Quattro always pays off for us, so glad it continued to do so, especially this weekend. Well, we have got a very good chance right here. Let's get all the way down. Very good chance that that little guy right there won. <laughs> A little bitty guy, 63 to 87. The current jackalope is sitting at 74.6. So this guy has a chance. Got to get under that 74. So let's go ahead and take him before anything crazy happens here. Should be solid. There he goes. There he goes. Man, I got to get that Argus off there. I keep forgetting we've got it on. Man, I'm zoomed in way too much. But let's go find out if that guy is a jackalope contender or not. All right, let's see here. We're looking to beat a 74.61. Oh, 77.2. Ah, too, too big. Look at that little guy, though. Pretty cool looking. <laughs> You don't ever go for these kind of things, so you never really look at them unless you're just cleaning herds out, but that's pretty cool looking. Got to get really low, though. I don't know if we're going to do that. That's the first 
level one I've seen the entire weekend so far, so pretty cool though. Oh well, back at it. Well, we have found another five over here. Maybe this is the troll we're looking for. But man, he looks really good. So I don't think he's a troll. That that is a big looking ram. Gorgeous. 165 to 189. Man, they gotta be 179. So small chance of a nice troll out of this, but I think we better go here. He's starting to win us, so we better go here. Gets his head back. Here we go. Should get in there good. Yep, no problem. He's almost down there. Awesome. Good deal. <laughs> Whoo, let's go find out. Alright, here we go. Here he is. Gosh, we'll see. Go oh, diamond 183 33 again the top diamond is much higher than that at 188 so still <laughs> diamond number two so glad we're out here what an awesome time I'm having I'm having a ton of fun so much fun hunting these guys and uh, wow look at that that's crazy just running around checking all the spots having a great time with these guys moving them along but man another nice ram right there Woo. diamond number two on the mouflon weekend that's awesome what a gorgeous gorgeous trophy these guys are now we got a couple of them look real good in the lodge together i bet and a another five there he is right out here we got to get across this hay field here he's up here on this side of the lake so maybe he's our first troll a 165 to 189 so again still has a really good chance he's got some pretty good looking horns on him too so oh he's gonna get walked just below that edge we don't want to see that work this around. Maybe we'll have to get up on one of these uh, hay bales. That rock looks like it's in the way there, so we need to get over here. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't think we can get up on this hay bale without him spooking. Maybe. Oh, he did. Good deal. We can take him from right here on this hay bale. That's perfect. I think. Make sure we're not that rock. Oh, we're clear. We're good. I don't think we can lay down here. Oh, we can. A little bit extra. I don't trust it. I hit the edge of the crest of that hill there too easy, I'm sure. Let's go with that. That should hammer. Oh yeah, he's already down. Boom. There he goes. Woo! Let's find out. Alright, here we go. Right on his spot where we shot him at. On his vital hit. Here we go. And <laughs> diamond. Nice. Number three for the weekend. 184.335 medium. 128 on the weight, 178.52 yards with the Solican double lung, no problem. Put him down right away. Wow, very nice diamond here. There are a ton of diamonds being shot this weekend by the people that are competing. So there are a lot of diamonds. So if you haven't been out and checking your mouflon, you might want to get out there and give them a chance and just hunt around a bit because uh, they can pretty much be on any of the water sources. As far as I know, here on uh, Quattro, so there's a lot of places to check. Lots of places to check. They could be hiding anywhere, but I would definitely get out there and check your stuff if you haven't, because there are a lot of them being entered this weekend, and I'm sure there's uh, many that are not even being entered because <laughs> they're not bigger than what's already there. So crazy, crazy. What a great weekend we've had. Three diamonds hat trick on the Mouflon.
already here. This is great. But still can't find those trolls. I can't believe that. Any other day, these would be trolls. At least two of them would have been. But that's uh, very nice. Very nice. Well, we've just spotted a, another five. And I'm hoping for a troll, but I don't think he is. Look how big those horns are. 166 to 190. Man, we're about right in range here. So is it a four pack on Quattro, a Diamond, Mouflon, or is this our troll we're looking for for the comp? I'll take a quartet of these uh, Mouflon, that's for sure. Man, possibly. Let's see. Here we go. Nice and smooth right there. That should be easy, double lungs. He's down. Woo! Man, let's go find out. Let's see. Oh, man, that's a big old Mouflon. And, oh, he is our troll we've been looking for. Finally. Holy cow. Ah, oh, I thought we had a four-pack there. But we finally got our troll, 175.92. Man, we don't have a whole lot of time left to try to get up here with these guys, but man, most of them are sitting in... Ah, the contenders are all up at... Man, 76, 78, 79, so this guy's not even really gonna help us a lot. But, uh, we finally found that troll we've been looking for. There have been a ton of trolls harvested in this competition, but we finally got ours, and, uh, very happy to have them. I just... Man, it's just not going to help us a whole lot. We're going to need at least two more bigger than this for sure. <laughs> Let's get back at it. That's the only way we're going to find out. All right, everyone. That's where we're going to leave it this week from Quattro, where we were season nine, week number three, and we were after the Mouflon here. And we had a trio of Trophy Diamond Mouflon this weekend. We were not able to even get close on those gold and we could not get very close to the top three they were so far ahead there was no point in even entering them because we could not get up in there in those high 170s we definitely tried to put a lot of time into this uh on the hunter compared to the angler this weekend and could not make it happen but you can't complain when you come away with three diamond mouflon for the whole weekend. It was a lot of uh, hustling and running and, and grinding these guys down, but we did make it happen and got the three of them here. So that's pretty cool. I, you, you notice, look at the difference in these mouflon. I mean, the nose on this guy is almost all white. These guys are more of a uh, darker face to them, so it's pretty cool. I, I like having them together. You can, you can see the uh, difference in the uh, different fur variations. This is pretty cool when you're uh, not talking about a rare. I, I really appreciate that in the uh, common uh, fur types. That's pretty cool. But again, Quattro comes away with the diamonds as usual. We, but what a great weekend! I'm so happy with this hat trick right here uh, of. Uh, of Mouflon. I was really hoping to get the four pack and get our quartet going, but that's all right. We are just fine with the three we got. We tried. We could not get into those top three. That was just the way it was for us this weekend. The jackalope wasn't working out. It was already pretty small and it was really hard. We only found one level one, if I remember right, at all. So very hard to get that jackalope but the uh sniper ward we didn't really go out and, and expand it the solo can usually hits really well for me but something's changed on it and i was struggling on long shots with it so i wasn't about to mess around with that and then as far as supreme huntsman our diamonds just weren't up to par to get up there this week and that's all right because we have already qualified and we're very happy with that so we're good to go for the tournament but that does it for season nine and week number three. And we will see where we go for week number four coming up. This coming weekend is the new map, the South African map for the angler. So probably gonna be putting in some time this week with that. And we'll have to 
always make time for the hunter. Of course, this weekend we'll see where that's going to be. But if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to stay notified and shoot the like button to help others find the channel. If you didn't, thank you for watching this long. Back to work on our next video. Until then.